simulation of a four-port DC-DC converter to integrate energy storage system and PV to supply local load demand final year project presentation team contents introduction problem of statement objectives methodology simulation results future works conclusion references introduction a four-port DC-DC converter consists of four ports one port connected to the input solar PV one port connected to the energy storage system for charging and discharging and two ports for the outputs. Four-port DC-DC converter is a good candidate for such a renewable power system which interfaces a renewable source with energy storage system. The converter operates in lagging PF mode for very wide variations in load and supply voltage in order to ensure zero voltage switching in all primary switches. General block diagram solar PV DC load 1, battery 4 port DC DC converter DC load 2 problem of statement 2 and 3 port converters are not efficient because of lot of switches with complicated driving and control circuitry. 2 and 3 port converters cannot produce two different DC output voltages. The occurrence of ripples in output. A 4 port converter solves the limitation of single output by producing two outputs. For example, when the solar PV is used in residential areas on the rooftop, one of the outputs can be used to supply the local load in the house, and another output can be used to deliver the remaining energy to the grid. The comparative analysis is done without transformer topology in order to achieve zero voltage switching for the power switches and to regulate the output voltage. The output of converter is free from ripples and has regulated output voltage. Solution objective small black square use of four port DC DC converter to integrate energy storage system and renewable source. Small black square to produce two DC output voltages to supply either two independent load or a single load. Small black square to supply grid or local load, AC. Methodology related theory. Simulink modeling on MATLAB for three modes of DC DC converter, DIDO mode, CIDO mode, and CEDO mode. Generation of pulse width on Simulink model. Variation of load pattern on resistance waveform testing and debugging final documentation operational modes of four port DC DC converter 1. DIDO mode switch S3 is kept OFF during this operation mode. Four different states in one switching period. Equivalent circuits and some key equations in each state of the converter during the DIDO mode are shown below with descriptions, A state IS1 and S2 are turned on, and S4 is turned off. Equations involved during this state, B state 2 at the end of state I, S2 is turned off and the operating state changes from state I to state 2. S1 is still turned eaten, and S4 is still turned off. Equations involved during this state, C state 3 when S1 is turned off, and S4 is turned on, the operating state changes from state 2 to state 3. Equations involved during this state, D state 4 at the end of state 3, S4 is turned off and the operating state changes from state 3 to state 4. S1, S2, and S4 are all turned off. Equations involved during this state, Key equations during DIDO mode using the volt second balance principle on the inductors and ampere second balance principle on the capacitors yields three equations which on manipulation jives, where, D1, D2, and D4 are the duty cycles of the switches S1, S2, and S4, respectively. Key waveform during DIDO mode 2. CIDO mode switch S2 is kept OFF in this operation mode. Four different switching states in one switching period. Equivalent circuits and some key equations in each state of the converter during the DIDO mode are shown below with descriptions, A state IS1 is turned on, and S3 and S4 are turned off. Equations involved during this state, B state 2 at the end of state I, S1 is turned off and the operating state changes from state I to state 2. S3 is turned on, and S1 and S4 are turned off. Equations involved during this state, C state 3 at the end of state 2, S3 is turned off, and S4 is turned on. The operating state changes from state 2 to state 3. S1 and S3 are turned off, and S4 is turned on. D state 4 S1, S2, and S4 are turned off. The operating state is exactly the same as that in state 4 described during the DIDO mode. Key equations during CIDO mode using the volt second balance principle on the inductors and ampere second balance principle on the capacitors yields three equations which on manipulation jives, where, D1, D3, and D4 are the duty cycles of the switches S1, S3, and S4, respectively. Key waveform during CIDO mode 3. CIDO mode switch S2 is kept on and S3 is kept off in this operation mode. Three different switching states in one switching period. Equivalent circuits and some key equations in each state of the converter during the CIDO mode are shown below with descriptions, A state IS1 is turned on, and S4 is turned off. Equations involved during this state, B state 2 at the end of state I. S1 is turned off and S4 is turned on. The operating state changes from state I to state 2. 
equations involved during this state, C state 3 at the end of state 2, S4 is turned off and the operating state changes from state 2 to state 3. S1 and S4 are all turned off. Equations involved during this state, key equations during CEDO mode using the volt second balance principle on the inductors and ampere second balance principle on the capacitors yields three equations which on manipulation gives, where, D1 and D4 are the duty cycles of the switches S1 and S4, respectively. Key waveform during CEDO mode detail block diagram. <laughs>